People want to know where their food's coming from these days. And to make that transparency known is one step to making our products more successful in these markets. This year we have just right at 1,800 acres of chickpeas. This is the beginning of something that's going to be uh, on, on somebody's table. Our chickpeas might be turned into hummus. Growing chickpeas is exciting. When I'm driving uh, on the roads and I can see my fields and how great they look, it makes you feel like your hard work was for something. The demand and acreage for chickpeas has definitely increased. I would say in the last six to 10 years, chickpea acres have tripled in the Pacific Northwest. This area is fantastic for growing chickpeas because of the consistent weather. We have good soils here. They just really like it. These are family farms. This is a family controlled co-op. It's nice to see it keep going down that track. My grandfather built the farm up to allow my dad to farm and his brothers to farm, which then has allowed me to farm. There's nothing better than working with your family. I love getting up every morning and I wouldn't change it. Is it hard work? By all means but the values, the work ethic you can instill in your kids and the meaning of family. To have this relationship with Sabra, they have the confidence to depend on us to grow them a quality product. Sabra does come out and they want to meet growers and interact with growers and be an integral part of what we're doing here in the Pacific Northwest. Everybody's in this together and we're all doing the same thing out here trying to trying to make it better for the next generation that comes along. And it's a good feeling when you go to the grocery store and you see Sabra's product. There's a pretty good chance that our beans are sitting there somewhere on that shelf.